So hi, my name is Robert Durant, and my uh, dealership is Robert Durant Heritage Coach. We are a s and and Superior dealer, and this car features our top-of-the-line model. It's the s and Masterpiece. Biggest, largest, most expansive purse in the industry with a whole bunch of amenities, aesthetic, and, and actually very purposeful. So uh, that's what we like about the purse because it does what it's supposed to do, look good and work properly. A lot of great amenities, the widest door opening, some fun things, you know, that people like to see is an airplane hinge that opens that rear compartment. Come on over. It's got a great sound system, too. Come on over. <laughs> Show you how it works, okay? So, when the door swings closed, very cool. So, with one button, how do you open it? You push the button. Okay. Oh, releases and it just walk it right around. Oh, very cool. Now, now does this hearse handle like uh, oversized caskets? This, ca this hearse in fact does. It's 43 inches wide. So it does in fact carry the oversized caskets. Now if you get a lot bigger you have to go get a Suburban. But you guys <laughs> yeah. are all familiar with that. Yeah. <laughs> One of the things that we like to feature about this hearse is the fact that it has the pull-out floor. So for those of you who are familiar with the hearses, you know that always a carpet and bumper protector that gets pretty ugly and pretty ragged. This is going to avoid that and give you the beautiful aesthetic appeal that you always want to see when you look at the inside of your hearse. So those are rollers that protect the edge. That's exactly. The edge. Protect the bumper. Okay. And help the pallbearers to get the hearse and the casket in, you know, without wiggling all over the place. These guys don't do it every day. Pallbearers do it once a year, once every 10 years maybe, and then probably every five years and maybe 10 years or so. So they're not, they're not familiar with how to do that. This helps them get the, get the guide to cast it in to the hearse. Okay, and then farther up I see, um, oh, what's that little thing sticking so up there? So up front there is a urn holder, which we didn't unpack because this hearse is going to a funeral home, okay. uh, going to the Joseph H. Brown Jr. funeral home in Baltimore, and we didn't want to unpack the urn holder, but that urn holder uh, this, it, it actually mounts right here, uh, just like the uh, beer pens do, and you can carry an urn in case you have a cremation. Mm -hmm. So this, it kind of gives you all the things that are necessary for hers to do a great job and be aesthetically appealing as well. And you've got like LED lights in the in the Two roof. Two full arrays of LEDs, which kind of present a better light on the on the mm -hmm. casket itself. Uh, and then you have the windows as well, mm -hmm. shedding light to the inside of the hearse. And they have very nice curtains, but these are yeah, very big yes. windows. Yes. And then, um, oh, I like the light here on the side. The light here rolls the chrome overlays, which adds to the beauty of the hearse and kind yeah. of makes it pop a little bit more. Yeah, and nice, nice wheels, yeah. too. Absolutely. <laughs> and then the sound system. about the music for a minute. The music <laughs> plays a major role in black funerals. It always has. So what we do here is we, have, we give the music to the funeral homes. We have mount speakers in the rear of the hearse as well. So that the cemetery, the funeral homes can feature music to comfort the souls and the hearts of the people who have lost loved ones. Very nice. Can people find more information about you online? Yes, or? they can. They can find more information at my website, robertpdurant.com. It's my pleasure to converse with anyone who comes on there. We have information available. So we'll have a good time talking about this industry and what we do here relative to the vehicles. Very good. Thank you. My pleasure.